Kasi basta may alam ka na sa anong kukunin mong major, let's say visual arts. If you know how to draw, if you know lang, like minimal, may idea ka kung ano lang gagawin mo, magaling na ka mag watercolor, may lang na mag-paint, kung ano pa dyan, okay lang. Because you're going to learn along the way. Because the te your teachers are there to support you, you have your classmates to ask advice. Guys, may Google at YouTube. Ano ba yung kinakabahan nyo? Sa so, akin lang, to be honest, if you're skillful na, and if you know what to do, talaga, <laughs> if you're very good in drawing, that's just like a plus point. Kaya, wag ka mag, don't get discouraged na, ay, I don't really know that much. I don't know how to dance. I don't know how to do that. To be completely honest, if you know what you're doing, you'll basically improve lang on the long run. Your teachers are there to support you. And as experience ko, you'll learn a lot from, from your classmates. Aside from they're going to, you can ask advice from them. They're going to inspire you 100%. So don't be afraid. Hindi lang ikaw, okay? Hindi lang ikaw. 
Ow. Everybody should help one another because you're working as a group, your grades are involved. Don't don't get so scared about it. Just chill. Thesis lang yan. Um, I'm so thankful I have a great research group no grade 12 kami. Uh, thank you so much! Basta yun lang, work hand in hand. Help each other. Kasi teamwork makes the dream work. Output, every single thing. Hindi lang visual arts. Madame pa. Music major man yan, dance, media, theater, whatever. I did an art installation, so what happened on production kami? First, we had production planning. It depends then by major. So, in my case, I'm a visual artist. I chose art installation. I did not paint nor did a sculpture. For my mga classmates na music, they composed their own song, which is chef's kiss. The dance, they dance, they stand galing ng mga classmates ko. After thinking of what you're going to do na, afterwards is critiquing. If when you're done na with the whole entire thing, your teachers are going to critique you about your output and don't get offended! <laughs> But they only mean well, because it's for the good of the event. So in ma in our case, na magbe face to face na I think hindi lang sa production yung teachers nyo magbibigay sa inyo. Whenever there's an event sa school nyo na involving art and design, I think constant yung critiquing jan. Kaya if your teachers are going to critique you, don't feel offended. Instead, improve, improvise, do better. <laughs> you are going to do some of the activities the other majors do. Yeah, be flexible. Again, guys, don't get scared. You're here to learn, you're here to improve, and you're here to test your capabilities. Kaya kung nakihiya ka, kapalin mo na yung mukha mo kasi hindi ka lang pwede magganda. I remembered, so kahit modular, modular kami. We had to do a TikTok dance. We did photography, which was supposed to be like some media, but we did that. Uh, like there was constant drawing then, say bang majors. I mean, drawing was a constant. It's arts and design, kaya tano major ka then. We also did creative writing. <laughs> oh, lahat yan ginawa namin yan. Yeah, be flexible. Don't be scared. Just do your best. Because no matter what activity or event yon, it still affects each and every single one of you. Like for our production, for example, we were just working as students, you know, like as a group for the whole entire production. Our teachers were involved and the other school namin. So working as a team is very important because it will reach something more than your goal. It will reach a beautiful it's just learning how to adapt lang talaga. So don't be afraid. Kaya mo yan. online, or magbe face to face, I think you should get used to drawing because there will be a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of drawing. Poster, lahat, illustration, slogan. Lahat guys, drawing na lang. Pati yung outing drawing. Because get used to drawing. There's nothing wrong to get used into something. If you don't know how to draw, Google, YouTube, kaya mo yan. Just get used to drawing. You might like it. There's general math. There is basic math, bro. So, we had statistics. We had the math. Those are what I remembered no grade 11 and I tell you, I am so done with math. Just kidding. Wag kang mag kasi kaya mo yan. To be completely honest with you, um, yes, take steps if you want to be an architecture student. Wait lang. I'm a bit discouraged that I did not 
take up to them because we go RT ako. We didn't have calculus, trigonometry, algebra. I mean, I think we had that no general math, but to be completely honest, we have calculus, shaka trigonometry, shaka precal, which STEM has, and we didn't have that. Or other math, pa siguro. If you took STEM, that's like plus points na, like additional knowledge for you to bring in architecture. So ayan nga, but recently, in grade 12, we had STM. So yeah, since we're face-to-face, maka magka-electives din kayo. If you're entering in the international high school, I'm sure you're going to have electives. In other schools, I am not quite sure about that. But to be honest, kung magkuha ka ng RK, just take up STEM. So ayan nga. Just have fun, okay? Um, if you're stressed, man, sa modules mo, sa teacher mo, sa friends mo, sa activities mo, please, take a break. Breathe. Um, go outside, go to a mall, eat food. Deserve mo yan, okay? Pray if you want to have that peace of mind that you're looking for. Kaya mo yan, okay? Okay, huwag na mag-overthink. Make friends in arts in the side. To be completely honest, my classmates were the best. They are artists. It felt like I'm talking to someone who understands what I'm doing. You know what I mean? I talked to my classmates. We maka relate kami sa isat isa. And it felt like a safe space for artists or people. You get, they get to understand your own mentality. They get to understand you as well. And above most, it inspires you, it helps you to grow into a better person and to the things that you're passionate about. From that, it inspired me that, hey, I have to push myself even more if I want to be good at what I'm passionate about. Kaya yeah, yun, it's, it's a safe space, it's not bad, it's not unhealthy competition. Tsaka walang competition, you know, it's a marathon, bro, it's not a race, it's a marathon. It's a great community for you, for you to express yourself. Kaya, if you're an arts and design student or an incoming arts and design student, don't feel afraid to make friends because your classmates are there to help and inspire you to become better. Okay, it's a great place, okay? <coughs> so apparently, you guys, my camera gave up already. <laughs> so yeah, this will be my last arts and design vlog, uh, uh, content, whatever you wanna call that. Uh, last na to, because mag mag-arky na ako mag-college. Thank you to my 71 subscribers. Thank you so much, you guys, for riding along this journey with me in senior high school. Um, <laughs> if, you ha if you're new here, please like and subscribe if you want to see more of my architecture content. Um, in the college ako and wherever else I'll go in this life. Also, shout out to Brando and Patrick. Uh, oh, to my classmates, um, good luck po sa inyo mag college. Um, if we have like a short amount of time spent, it was worth, uh, worthwhile. I enjoyed every single, single of it. Every single one of it. Uh, you are very, very unique people that I've met and I'm grateful for that. This chapter of my life. Thank you so much you guys. I have nothing else to say na dami kong sinabi kaso yung camera ko it shut down na. Anyways I hope you do watch more of my videos. Uh, I'll be po posting more soon about my college stuff. Anyways you guys, thank you thank you so much. I will see you guys on my next one. Also links down below for other arts and design content. Okay? Bye guys! Love you. Don't forget to drink your water. Take your vitamins. Stay safe, y'all. Bye! Love it how you love me electric Like you do Love it how you love me